Hello, everyone, and welcome to a brand new episode of Crypto Clout. I am your host, Phase Crypto. Today, we are watching Bitcoin's price down another 3.07%, Ethereum down another 4.56% on the 24 hour. A lot of the market is following this trend. Spell token currently down 9.90%. The entire market pretty much getting hit hard by. A lot of these different public health issues that we're watching that should be coming up, uh, looming lockdowns for a lot of people coming up in in uh, the end of the year or the beginning of next year, January. Uh, a lot of different issues going on with mining, and of course, a lot of people are probably locking in losses, doing um, you know tax sell-offs and all this sort of stuff. So. Very, very interesting to watch what's been happening right now. The cryptocurrency space really is kind of predictable at the end of the year. This happens pretty often uh, if you look um, just at any uh, all-time chart. You know, de- December's tend to have these these sort of uh, you know activity, which uh, I mean. Uh, it's just par for the course in the world of crypto. If or, I mean, I'm sure people are well aware of it, but uh, I mean, it, it's ha- it almost happens like clockwork. Regardless, I want to talk about Spell Token. Um, does it score uh, well on short-term trading metrics? Um, so this is a um, Investor's Observer article. It says, uh, Spell Token receives a strong short-term signal score of 97 from Investor Observer Analysis. Uh, a scoring system considering the recent trading patterns of the token, looking at the price movement to determine if it is trending in the right direction. Spell holds a better recent technical analysis uh, than 97% of tokens at its current price. Uh, investors who are focusing on short-term growth and looking for hot and trendy coins will find the short-term rank especially relevant when allocating their assets. The trading analysis goes as followed, saying that Spell Token is uh, 0.015750, which is 227.86% higher than its 30-day low price of 0.006912, while also 0.005114, which is negative 18.41 18.41 lower than its high of, of course, two cents and then 77% of a penny from the past month of trading. Meanwhile, Spell's current price of two pennies and then 20% of a penny is above that its average price of uh, a penny and then 60% of a penny set uh, over the past month of trading, uh, leading to a strong short term technical score. In summation, the recent trading history of Spell Token suggests the traders are currently bullish on the token. Spell has a relatively high market cap for a token with a total value. That's a big number. Spell Token's market value is uh, relatively high since the largest 100 cryptos have a market cap above $1 billion and Spell meets that criteria. Spell Token's average volume, meanwhile, is high with... Uh, Another really big number and 360 uh, million uh, worth of tokens traded over a typical 24 hour period. Uh, the crypto's volume is relatively high due to the most traded 100 cryptos typically having $100 million worth of the crypto traded over a uh, 24 hour period as of the past 24 hours. Spell's volume is below its average uh, with 112 million exchanged. Spell Token's uh, price movement over the past month has led to a short, well, a strong short term technical score due to recent trading, giving more bullish signals for traders on the token's short term movement. So that's a short-term analysis of Spell Token, as and it does align with my analysis as long as it can maintain itself above that 0.08 point, um, oh, point you know, 0.07 um, range. Um, obviously, I think that it's still in bullish territory. That, of course, is notwithstanding the 
activities that we might see happening with Bitcoin and Ethereum, such as if, Bitcoin, if Ethereum drops down to $2,000 and Bitcoin drops down below the $40,000 range, then the entire market's going to be in a free fall. And ladies and gentlemen, that'll be a Black Friday sale that the likes of which we've never, we haven't seen for quite a long time. And uh, personally, I would see that as an awesome opportunity to accumulate. You know, the crypto market always bounces back eventually. So, I mean, it is interesting just to look at how a lot of these different variables have been sort of coming together. But personally, I do see Spell Token as a long-term um, investment. Um, I can see the potential for a $1 Spell Token. The importance of uh, these stable coins has only uh, skyrocketed, especially in this uh, market. Everybody's flooding over to USDT. Uh, you know, of course, trying to there, you know, other sort of tether and the like. And of course, that's one of the main things you know Spell Token has going for it is um, the uh, you know uh, stable coins and so forth. So. Um, you know, uh, congratulations if you bought all that, uh, you know, of course, uh, and then, uh, interesting, uh, tweets all around, uh, just a general interesting sentiment spell tokens still, uh, bringing in, um, over 300 tweets, uh, you know, and then of course over 300 tweets a day. And at the same time we have, um, you know, we, have, well, what's going on right now is, um, uh, you know, we're looking forward to the burn, you know, the 6 billion spell tokens that are going to be burned in the beginning of January. Um, I don't know how that will re reflect on the price of spell token uh, immediately, but I think on the long term, uh, that is an interesting sentiment that we could see. So uh, there are a lot of good things to look forward to in the cryptocurrency space, but at the same time, we need to uh, you know, you need to be doing the things that are worth, you know, worth it to you, you know, the best decisions that you think that are, um, you know, they're available for you to make, uh, you know, with the circumstances that you've made for yourself, um, and the circumstances that you've dealt with and that, you know, that you've inherited. So all that being said, I hope that you guys enjoyed uh, this video. You know, remember this video is for entertainment, educational purposes only. I'm not your dad, I'm not your financial advisor. I do enjoy making these videos on Spell Token. I think that it's a great project. Uh, and I'm really glad to be um, building this community here on YouTube surrounding Spell Token so that when it does pop off and all the hater, all the noobs and, uh, you know, all the retail money and, you know, millions of people start giving attention to this token, you know, you will know that we were here first. So uh, remember, comment down below and, um, you know, upvote this video for the algorithm. I'll see you guys in the next video. Have a good one.